Our system is being corrupted. This game has gone far enough. I will have her transmission removed in a moment. Despite the loss of the priests, Earth will fall and my people will survive. I will answer the humans' prayers, reward those that believe. This hub was of Maker design. She knows the systems well. The final priest will be moved to a more discreet location, so our work can continue without further disruption. The third Hell Priest signal is no longer visible to us. There is a 41.3% increase of demonic activity at the nexus of the initial invasion. That is the largest gore nest on Earth. I will set the portal coordinates for the super gore nest now. Hey guys, welcome back to more Doom Eternal. This is pretty insane. We got invaded and corrupted and disabled. So it looks like we're gonna have to go and fight the gore nest. In the last couple of missions, we picked up a lot of batteries, and I think they can be used in our fortress. I s let me see, can we use it here? Available batteries, three. Yeah, sure, let's use this, because we can use two here, and I have absolutely no idea what we can unlock with them, if it's gonna help us, or if it's just, um, like this suit, is it gonna be something that helps us, or is it gonna be something that's just for looks? Let's actually have a look at this. <laughs> You unlocked a custom skin for the Slayer. Oh, it's just a custom skin. Okay, I see. Custom skins change appearance of the Slayers throughout the game. Go to customize. Uh, I see. Okay, so this is not really giving us a, an advantage in fight or something, but it's just an outfit. <laughs> there is this cool room here that I found in our fortress looking around. Where we can actually look at all our weapons in 3D, which is really, really cool. Absolutely fantastic. I love this like so we can look at all of them swap the mods on them See what the different mods look like uh, on them like here with this one We have that special sniper mod the rocket mod. This is amazing I absolutely love this and then here we have I don't know some other things that are looking really odd But all the things we collect we pick oh here's a oh it, Oh, this is probably where we can listen to all the music tapes we find we're not gonna do that copyright incoming, but look at that shelf this is so awesome! All the things we actually find, we can see here. That is so cool. I also totally forgot that we actually collect these suit points and arsenal points. I just spent all my points on upgrading my shotgun all the way as much as I can. This is something that we have to spend either one of those special tokens for, I have no idea how to earn, or we just complete the challenge. Other gun I use a lot, the plasma rifle, which is my second most used gun. I increased um, Heat Blast, which basically is a quick fire, firing delay after using the Heat Blast to reduce by 25, and then I unlock this, um, which is superheated rounds, Heat Blast charge per shot is increased by 25%, and then Power Surge is what we unlock if we kill at least two demons with a single Heat Blast 30 times. I also upgraded actually the second part of my auto um, shotgun, which is the auto firing actually, so I unlocked all these, which should make it easier to swap mods now and um, kill a demon with full auto mod will drop shell armor. That is actually something that I would love to unlock. Kill 15 pinkies with full auto mod. Okay. We also actually completely forgot have the suit points that we have to unlock and um, we have nine suit points. So yeah, I think I'm going to go for a faster weapon switch and mod swap. So I'm not going to go for anything specific with the ice grenade or the frag grenade. So we're going to do that first hot swapper. And then dash refills more quickly or dash refills and glory kills. I would say dash refills more quickly. Do that first. And then later on we can unlock that. And then I maybe focus on one of the more specific ones. This one here is to do with our um, environmental suit. Which uh, the hazard protection, which I'm not really sure I'll be using a lot anyway. And then I'm going to look at frag grenades and ice. So the next one may be actually be the ice. Because that looks pretty awesome as well. Enough shenanigans so Let's continue. Okay, that actually picked up a new weapon, a ballista ammo type cell. So that uses the same ammunition as our plasma rifle. Pro tips, bonus damage to energy shields, penetrates through fodder demons. Just before we get into it, this is actually the second time I'm recording this mission. 
For some reason, the whole mission was a complete lag fest in the recording. I have no idea what happened, guys. It didn't lag during the gameplay, but the video recording was complete scrap. So, um, yeah, we're going to do it again. Hopefully it goes well. Well, if you see it, then it must have gone well. <laughs> I hope. All right, because I'm replaying the mission, a lot of the things that I upgraded are already upgraded. So let's just go over it quickly. You've seen already that I was playing around with my suit points. I actually finished the suit upgrade and I already got another upgrade with the ice bomb. So I'm not really sure how this works now when we replay a mission, if we get more points, if they're all gone or not. But we're going to play through it because um, it's very interesting what we have Please to do. Please remain calm. You may notice a slight change in the environment. Here we go, nice, love it. The Super Gornest location is nearby. This is the site where the invasion began. The oldest and most corrupted location on the planet. The Ark fought hard, but they were eventually driven out by the demons. Okay. So the funny thing is this this level is very, very big and it's quite confusing actually. So if I get lost even though I played it before. Um, I apologize. It is huge and it looks absolutely amazing. This is probably the best looking level so far that we've played. I think so anyway. It looks absolutely fantastic. And we also got a new gun actually. You might see that here in our arsenal. This is a gun that we pick up halfway through the mission. So sorry for the spoilers guys if you haven't seen it yet or if you haven't played it yet or you're looking forward to do it yourself. It's a, ra a rail gun. It's absolutely beautiful and it works great when you freeze your opponents um, while you actually shoot at them. And it has a shield mod on it which is even better. So yeah, you can see this is actually gone. There was a extra life here. Oh, the extra life is back. That's interesting. So that was actually sitting on top of a pillar. Oh, there it is. Yeah, <laughs> the pillar only moves up when you get in. Okay, okay, hang on a second, guys. There we go, nice. Beautiful. Okay, we have the big guy here. There we go, nice. This big guy, I'm not really sure what weapon works best against him yet. I'm really not sure. I know with this we can uh, take his weapons out. Usually three grenades will do it, but it has to be a better way of dealing with him. Maybe the grenades are okay, but it's a, maybe a rocket launcher. Yeah, a rocket launcher might actually do the trick after you take his weapons out. Maybe. Okay, so let's go across here. Whoa. So the secrets are gone actually guys, so I apologize about that, but if I remember, I can try to show you the secret uh, location. Come on, it's reloading and there we go, nice. So let's try that out. Okay, one rocket launcher. Oh, hang on. Okay, oh. Two rocket launchers. Okay, so two rocket launchers seem to do the trick then afterwards. That's actually really good to know. Oh, there's another one. Oh, that's bad. Let's see how many rocket launchers we can get into him. Two. Three. Okay, four rocket... Oh, wow, okay. You can't say he's spineless. Definitely isn't. Um, okay, we need ammunition. There we go. Nice. Beautiful. Okay, where's the big guy? There was a big guy here somewhere. Okay, let's just take a, make a legger for it. There we go, nice. Oh, but I got a big guy. Oh, that's unfair. Okay, we're doing okay actually with the ammo and everything. So there's a... Come on, guys. Come on. There you go. Yeah, 
Yeah, this guy is pretty hardcore. Um, oh no, wow, okay. Get some ammunition here. Where do we have our explodey barrels? Here's an explodey barrel, so let's see if they're coming in. I would like them to come for me with the explodey barrel. Come on. There we go, nice. Whew. Yeah, very hectic here. The initial um, wave that you have to deal with here is insane. Yeah, these guys I'm not really sure how to deal with either properly. They're very fast. Maybe we should freeze them. And then just blast them. I don't know. That probably works best. We need some ammunition. Okay, I think that's it. Yes. Oh, is that a pinky? Because we were told to kill pinkies with the auto shotgun, I think. There we go. Nice. Because I think this is one of the... Um, Achievements we have to unlock this so if we look at our arsenal Our full automatic weapon there we go pinky. It was a pinky I don't remember most of the names of the of the of the demons But kill a demon with a full auto mod will drop shell ammo So that is really interesting. So if we kill 15 pinkies in total with auto mod Then we get that unlocked which is really awesome. And what is the other one actually again? Let me see for sticky bombs destroy Arachnatron turrets. I don't even know what they look like anymore. There was a secret behind this door, but you need a blue key for that, as you can see. There is a secret behind there, which you also need a blue key. And there is a secret up here. Let's see if I can manage to get up there. Ah, okay. It's actually right there above. Let's see if I can do it. There we go. So you kind of have to turn around just before you grab the last one and right up here is a secret so just in case you're interested in that because i know some of you may watch the videos uh, to see where the secrets are or how to get to them and the ones we find might help you out so and because i already played it i thought i might show you this again let's go i think there's a battery here or something i don't really remember 100 percent okay and this gate is closed until later so let's go down here there we go. Oh yeah, we have to do it from the Let me see. There we go. Probably be better off pretending I haven't played it before, to be honest, uh, because my mem memory is very shoddy. Oh, we actually have to. I remember the blast now. Yeah, that's right. So we have to actually kill the kill with blast. So let's see if we can do that. Excellent, so that should have counted as one. Let me just double check that. So if we go to our special weapon heat blast, yes, that counts as one. So 30 times we have to trigger it, killing more than one demon, basically. So we're just gonna keep doing that. Ooh, hello, still moving around. Oh, crap. Excellent. Let's get some ammunition. Some armor. We need two demons. There we go. Come on, guys. There we go. Nice. Oh, beautiful. He's giving a lot of armor. Oh no, that's bad. Sticky grenade. Um, rocket launcher. There we go. Nice. Get some health back. Do we get armor? And we need some ammunition. Okay, nobody left. Let's 
go and get the key. Oh yeah, this. Um, they won't explain it to you again, but right here you see this hammer. It's very hard for me to show. Actually, hang on. So there's this hammer and you have to mail it because it gives special powers to um, the demons. That's why they're red. So if you haven't seen that before, that's why that is. The game doesn't seem to trigger the um, explanations on that again. So these guys will just spawn over and over to that skill. Now. The way to get there is here. There we go. There we go. We went into one of the portals. The one we need to is not unlocked. There we go. There's a seal here. Ow! Hang on a second. This is getting really dangerous. <laughs> Demons can be an offensive term. There we go, we got some armor at least. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Can we so no, we can't saw him in half because he's not a simple demon. Oh, there we go. That's what it is. Brilliant. Now these guys are all back to normal. Now we need some ammunition. I don't think we can chainsaw this guy. Okay, now this is open. This will... Um, trigger a special event and if you kill every single demon during the special event um, you win but it's very hard I show you we can try it it's very hard and you don't get your ammunition back We have three seconds left. Is that the last one? How did we fail it? He was dead! Only because he didn't blow up. I think we actually would have made it if he would have blown up a bit faster. Oh, that was not fair. So, secret is don't use uh, kill animations because they take forever to execute and waste at least four seconds of your time. That is not cool. Okay, so we're not gonna do it again because we're literally out of ammunition. So, let's move on. There's one of the keys. We got a yellow key now. Okay, this is for this yellow door here. Let's go. We need ammunition. Earth is the melting pot of the universe. So right here, if you go up, I think there is another... Plasma rifles will make energy explode. Yeah, so here's another one of those, but we already used it. I'm just going to show it to you. Let's continue. Let's go. Get some ammunition here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, I'm locked out. I'm locked out. Big guys. There we go. Get some health. Out of shotgun. Yes, thank you. Got him. Oh my lord. This is hectic. Oh, 
Oh! You ninja! Okay, he's dead. We're low on ammo, we're low on ammo, we're low on health. There we go, nice. Now we got both back. Sweet. Ah, this guy, seriously? God, I panicked. It's like, why would it not work? There we go. Oh, oh, wrong mod, wrong mod. Come on. There we go. This is so stressful, this level. They're coming from all sides. It is so confusing. Okay, these guys are gone. Oh my god. There we go, got him. Whew, very stressful level. Also, this here, um, we have a key for this. I actually did that during the original recording, um, which was pretty cool. Let's pick up this guy. I don't remember exactly what's happening. But let's go up here because this is the area we couldn't really explore originally because this is where the big kahunas came from. Go some rockets, very nice. And this is how we get back to the main entrance. So this is where we were originally. So once we have the blue key, we can get into there. And this is the gate that opened now once you cleared this area out. So let's go over here. Oh, there's another skull. Excellent. This actually gives us an onslaught buff, which I don't know exactly what it does, but we probably could have made use of that earlier. Two more keys will be required to open the passage. Find them 